Hi everyone, this is Parth and you're watching Infobel. And this is a very short video on Open Beta 23 and 21, which OnePlus has released for OnePlus 5T and 5 respectively. Now we have to really appreciate OnePlus's effort for pushing an update in such a short time, although the update is relatively small and will not bring any new feature as such, this update is more of bug fixes and security patch update. Now as always, if you are already on open beta 20, you have received an OTA update. But if you are on stable build, you have to download the ROM from their official website. I'll leave a link in the description area. Now I have already explained how to install the ROM manually in the previous video. I'll leave a link of that video in the description. Now if you go through the change log, the Android security patch has been updated to December 2018. Fixed issues with custom accent color not getting applied every second try. Optimization for face unlock, fixed UI issues with scroller in the app drawer, and improved color adaptation for navigation bar. Now we can see the security patch update in the settings going into the about phone section, but all other changes are at system level and some bug fixes which I mostly was not facing, so I cannot show those changes. But some of you like me is facing the issue of sudden restart of phone, especially when you are on call. And if your phone is idle for some time, the face unlock and fingerprint scanner is not working and you have to manually enter the pin. And also, the UI is getting updated like if you have restarted the phone. This has happened to me throughout the day, but I am able to find a somewhat temporary fix for that. Now if you all remember, with Android Pie, a new feature was introduced, which is called Adaptive Battery. But what I feel as of now, this feature is buggy and it is reacting to our phone usage too aggressively. So I have turned it off. Now it has been more than half a day and till now phone has not restarted. If you are also facing the same issue, you can try the same method. Now let me know in the comments what are the bugs you are facing in this build and I will try to find a way to temporarily fix those issues. That's all for this video guys. Share this video with your friends if they are also facing the same issue and subscribe to the channel to stay in touch for upcoming videos. This is Parth from InfoPal and I will see you in the next video.